This is Nori from Obubuti. Thank you for being here. Today I will be your guide to show you how Akisan, our crazy president and lead farmer, makes our pie needle wakocha, a beautiful needle-shaped Japanese black tea. The format of this video will be a little different from the previous I made. This time I decided to make a kind of vlog and take you along with me everywhere from the harvest in the tea fields through to the process in our factory. And I will show you in details all the steps involved in the making of this very special tea with a fair share of good and bad surprises. Through this video, I hope to be able to show you how interesting and funny, though uh, pretty hard and unpredictable tea making can be. And I hope you will enjoy it. Now let's start the adventure. You have the recipe of the gasoline. <gasps> Oil to gasoline. Hi. お願いします。準備が大事。プレートを動きやすくします。では、ハーブしましょう。おい。pretty big we are at the beginning of June so we are gonna harvest only the top part of the bud we don't want to take the lower leaves because it's too hard so we're gonna harvest only this part and this is gonna make us a delicious tea <laughs> harvested the tea buds to make our black tea and now they're trimming the bushes again to make some bancha. 
right. So the tea is ready to go back to the factory. Dewa, go by. Tonight, uh, we will continue the rolling in the last shaping machine. So now the leaves are pretty well brownish. The aroma is very good. So now we want to roll them even more to accelerate the oxidation process before we shape them into beautiful needles.
During this rolling part, it's important to check the leaves very often to verify that the temperature is not too high because this could affect the taste of the tea at the end. So there are still some green leaves remaining, but the aroma is quite nice and I'm afraid that if I roll them more, it will become too powdery. I think we should try like five more minutes and then take the leaves out and go with the next batch. So just to show you the difference, this is before the twisting and this is after the twisting. A few moments later. All right, so we finished the twisting and now we're gonna put the leaves back in the tumbling machine to dry them a little bit before putting them in the shaping machine. It's gonna take some time. The aroma of the leaves is still good but it's time now to stop the oxidation by heating the leaves. We don't want the oxidation to continue too far because then it's gonna ferment and this is not what we want. This is uh, the end of the making of our Japanese black tea, Wakocha. We hope that you enjoyed this vlog. We had a lot of fun making this tea and also taking all these videos for you. Akki-san, the answer is how do you make the Wakocha? Hmm, this year's Wakocha is... How do you make it? Well, it's a little bit... I changed the process. This is the low temperature process. If you are one of our tea club members or if you plan uh, to purchase our black tea, we hope that you will enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you want to see more videos about tea harvesting, tea making, Akisan of course, and uh, just our life here at Ogugu in Mozuka town in Kyoto Prefecture. For people who are interested in our tea club, I will put all the details in the description just below, so uh, make sure to have a look. We will also put the green guide just over here, so you can have a guideline when you brew this wakocha. Of course, this is just like an example of brewing, but you can brew it in many, many different ways. So please find your own style, the way you prefer, the way you like. This is the most important. Please use super boiled water! 
い。<笑>これはアキさんのアドバイスですね。うん、はい。<笑> Don't forget boiling water. Don't forget. じゃあもうそれで。Thank you very much again for watching this video and see you next time. Please enjoy. Bye bye. Bubble tea. Black tea.